it was brought to our attention by one of our viewers that using Gorilla Tape as a frame protector may be a problem if you want to remove that tape. It might pull off the clear coat, the paint, and the underlying decal. So we set out to do an experiment. I know it's not ideal because it won't be subject to the everyday outside weather conditions, but it's the best we can do. So let's take a look. We dug into our parts box and were able to come up with an aluminum and carbon fiber fork for our demonstration. We've washed it and thoroughly dried both of these. We're going to wipe both sides of each fork with some isopropyl alcohol to remove any grease that possibly from our fingers. When dealing with aluminum, especially, it's best to let it warm up to room temperature if you've had it in a cold spot or it's been outside. To one side of each fork, we'll apply some of the Gorilla Tape. Pushing down on the middle. And then working our way to each side so it covers the decals. To the left side of the fork, we'll use our helicopter tape, carefully, carefully peeling it off from the paper and trying to touch only the very edge. We'll go ahead and wet the fork and the, the helicopter tape and begin application, pressing in the center. And then moving outward with our fingers. As we go, we'll heat the center with our hair dryer and continue. Pushing outward to get all the bubbles out. We'll do the same for the carbon fiber, but when we use the hair dryer, we're going to hold it further away because we don't want it to melt or damage any of the glue that holds the carbon fiber together. So we'll go ahead and wet it down. And then we're going to let these both sit for maybe a week before we try to go ahead and peel this off and see what it does to the aluminum and carbon fiber. So this is sat here for a week. We'll go ahead and first remove the Gorilla Tape from the aluminum and carbon fiber and we're told to remove it slowly. As we can see here, it seemed to remove a tiny portion of paint at the very top and possibly down below. That's hard to evaluate and I don't know if you can see it on the film, but there may be a little bit of the clear coat, but very minimal. Now we'll remove it from the carbon fiber.
Up here it looked like it removed pretty well. There's still a little bit of sticky material on here that could be cleaned. A little alcohol. Here where I pulled it a little faster, we can see it removes some of the uh, surface clear coat and underlying paint. Now we'll turn our attention to the helicopter tape. We're going to peel part way, just straightly, easily pulling it off. And then we're going to use, as some suggest, our hair dryer to see if, as we warm it up, it removes a little bit easier. Let's go ahead and try. Well, so far, this seems to come off very nicely. This was already here comes off very nicely. It doesn't seem to be pulling any of the clear coat or underlying paint. Let's try the hair dryer and we'll pull it the rest of the way off. Using the hair dryer actually comes off easier. Any marks that you may see were marks that were already there. And the uh, tape itself looks pretty good. So I don't think we've removed any of the clear coat or paint with the helicopter tape. Now we'll turn our attention to the carbon fiber fork. We'll do the same thing, only we're going to hold the, heat, the hair dryer a little further back on the bottom half so we don't damage the underlying carbon fiber. Let's first pull off the first half, slowly. Comes off very nicely and very clean. We also looked at Mariposo Effecto tape, which is a bulky but heavy duty frame protector tape from Italy. We applied this when we pull it off, both the aluminum and the carbon fiber the tape appears clear. It does not seem to be pulling off any of the clear coat or paint or decal. So it's uh, an effective tape that can be used. It would appear, at least from our small study here, that the helicopter tape and Mariposa Effecto tape are superior, at least in terms of removal, to the Gorilla tape. And the Gorilla tape is just a budget source for frame protection. Word of caution when dealing with carbon fiber, I would be cautious in removing any frame protector tape or anything else applied to the surface of the carbon fiber. If you know of frame protector tape that you can easily apply that will stay on and still be removed, especially from carbon fiber, please comment below and let us know. Subscribe to keep up with our latest videos. This is Tony of Tony 10 Speed Safe Cycling.